<laughs> Hello, welcome back to Space Engineers, and, uh, okay, it's not entirely my fault, not entirely, um, I will take partial credit, responsibility, whatever for it, but it's not entirely my fault. Here's what happened. Uh, at the end of that one video where I was having trouble getting the, uh, merge blocks to work properly, and I ended up smashing the tortoise up really bad trying to get that to work and I I showed you that I did not save the game after that happened so I returned uh, I exited out of the game actually and the next day I came back to play and I thought well they've done some bug repairs maybe I can get the experimental branch to work and I thought you know wouldn't it be really cool I need to do some uh, building I need to build a platform I was gonna put this big platform over here cuz I was having trouble let's let's just go ahead and do this I was having trouble getting these this you know testing the docking procedure over here and everything to like that so I wanted to make it so that I could test the docking procedure without this thing drifting off into space and obviously having one of these guys clamped onto it didn't work so <laughs> here's what I did I was gonna do a uh, time lapse so I turned off the microphone and I came in here in the experimental and I was able to dig a tunnel through the side of this mountain and then I started building the blocks using the experimental building system and I got out to about where does the gravity end right about here and the game froze up on me I was like crap so I go to reload it the save game is corrupted so I have to reload from an earlier save game which was this one here where I had just attached the two and I hadn't gone through and changed up all of these heavy armor plates to the regular armor plates. So, I was like, ah, damn it, to hell and back. So I loaded up and I'd, I go to record another video and I'm sitting here doing this and I'm like, hey, you know, I explained everything that happened and I'm replacing these plates and I was like, okay, so I'm not going to make you watch me replace all of these plates just to, here's how I do it this is such a tedious job it's a pain in the ass and all this well while I'm doing that I see a little red guy over there and it's uh, it says mining transport which is what this guy is see it says mining transport and he was out there about uh, I don't know about nine kilometers out and I said, wow, mining transport. I'm going to go get that. I thought it was a mining caravan like one of these. I was expecting one of these. And I thought, yeah, no, these guys are easy. I like them. And they've got lots of goody stuff in them. <sighs> so I drop off the steel plates that I was carrying. And I haul ass out there. And I find out it's this guy. And as you can see, he's got a turret on both sides. And this is actually the back of it. So I, I was, you know, I came up out it and I was like, ah, and I flew, I was way out, but I flew around it and I ended up getting shot and died. But not before this turret had shot this cargo container to the point where it was just below that red line, okay? And he also shot some of these plates out and shot out this refinery here and well both of them and they shot out the ore detector you know they, they basically made a mess of the thing so when I came back using just the regular welder and grinder I came up on this side and this turret was deactivated because the crate it was connected to was deactivated so I was like well I can do this reactor right here real quick now how do I get inside this thing without getting near that turret well right here there's a piece of glass which I ground through 
And then I ground through this, took control of the ship, turned on the inertial dampeners, when it came to a complete stop, shut off all the power, and proceeded to look around to find out what I can do with it. And as I was doing that, I found out down here there was a door. And I ground it off, and this guy was inside, but the power was off, so he was no match for anything. So I ground him down, I repaired the cargo container, and it's got... Huh. I must have taken the stuff out of it. He had ammo and uh, ore in it. Anyway, so I ground down this door, and that just leads back to here. Got the... Uh, the beacon, got the gravity generator, I checked to see what else needed to be done, yeah, 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 you know, the whole routine, I had to get the, uh, these two connectors here, I had to grind down the one reactor, uh, well, here's the gyros I had to do, this one was damaged, but the other three were fine, this, uh, was damaged, so anyway, I bring the thing back home, and I'm like, haha, I feel so good, I did that. And I went to post a video, and I noticed, oh crap, I still had the microphone turned off. So there was no audio for that entire section. So I was like, damn it. <laughs> and that's what that assailant's doing. I don't know why he's over there, because this thing was over that way. But now there's an assailant hanging out over here. And I should go over there and kick his butt just because he's hanging out so close. Ah, <sighs> so. Here we are, back to this position. So I am going to... Leave that alone for right now, although I'm going to, uh, let's see, do I have a drill in here? Yes, I have a drill. I don't know why there's a drill in the grinder. They should have a grinder and a welder in it, not a drill. Does this have a drill in it? Watch this have the grinder and welder, right? Nope, it didn't have anything. Okay. Uh, but, yeah, this is before I did the, uh... Starship Rhinoplasty and all that. This is... Before I did any of that stuff. So this is still the same... Let's see if there's anything else is... Nope, okay, so this is still this. So, it wasn't entirely my fault. I just tried to use the uh, experimental branch and it said, nope, we're gonna screw up your save game. I didn't think it would actually corrupt the save game. I didn't honestly think that it would, but... So, I was thinking about going out this side, but this is such a long hallway. Wait a minute, let me just... Plus, there's a lot of asteroid in the way this way. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Huh. Plus, I've died coming down that hallway before. Alright, so let's go back to this way. And I'm going to be right-click drilling. Uh, 
Yay, okay. Yeah, that's not that far at all. Alright, so we need to get rid of this. Because I'm going to need to run a uh, conveyor system out here. Alright, so we are one, two, three... Okay. Let me go get some metal plate. Get out of the way. That's what happened. All of the ores that this thing had on it, it got sucked into the refinery and it's been processing them this whole time without me even knowing it. So that's kind of cool. Alright. Wait a minute. I know I didn't have to do that. Now I have to carry this out until gravity stops. That's important. Okay, here's no gravity, here is gravity. Okay, so. In no gravity. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Gravity here, no gravity here. I love that. That's important. Alright, so this is basically what I'm going to end up doing. And that's uh, one, two, five, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, nine. Ten. Having a hard time going straight back for some reason.
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Mining hauler. You're a mining transport. Now I've got a mining hauler out over there. So that's the mining caravan. This is the mining transport. What's a mining hauler going to look like? Do we want to know? Do we want to? So this is the platform I'm going to build. And then I'm going to park the lily pad on top of it. And we're going to work on building this whole system and making it work properly. Yeah, let's go check out this. At the very least, let's go look at it. Okay, so, uh, again, I don't know what a mining hauler looks like, but I guess we'll find out in a couple of seconds. And, let's see, so far nothing. <laughs> e, 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 e. It appears to be moving down relative to my so yeah I'm approaching full speed dampeners off so I don't have to keep constantly thrusting I'll turn him back on to slow me down then I have to turn him back off again to keep match speed with it so I want them on so I can be more maneuverable until I get close to it. Get a good look at it. I'm going to try to keep out of weapons range if I can, but I do want them to fire at me so that I can see where they are. Uh, it looks like it's got a turret on either side. So no real blind spot. Holy crap, there's another one down there. And another one up top. I wonder if I can get it to shoot itself. Enough to take out one of the turrets. Nope. Wow, it only needed to hit me once. That was pretty impressive.
I should just keep a couple of these. with that thing it's got four turrets on it I'll have to build a ship or something to go after that that is something I plan on doing one of these days <sighs> he stopped He's actually coming closer. Huh. I wonder what would happen if I took one of these guys out after it. It's only got one turret on it, though. Maybe I'll take this guy. He's got two turrets. Eh, these guys are more expendable. Let's just see what happens. I'll do a flyby. I shouldn't do that with full of plates. What am I thinking? <laughs> I just noticed my inventory I'm full of steel plates. It's probably a bad idea to be doing this. Oh crap, he's got rockets. I'm out of here. He 
huge guy rockets, man. Forget that. So, <laughs> yeah, I'm going to need a little something, something a little bit more uh, than just a single Gatling. I thought I was doing good. I was like, wow, it looks like I'm doing tearing that guy up pretty bad. And he was like, oh, oh I haven't even gotten the rockets out yet. <laughs> So I left a few chunks behind. That was okay. I almost wish his antenna had gotten shot off. What? Looked like something exploded. Or it sounded like, at least. What I ought to do is put a whole crap load of turrets on one of these things. Maybe some rocket launchers. I don't want to go smashing into that frame I just did. I have no thrusters on the right side. Okay, well, I'll probably tear this one apart for, uh, scrap. It gave it a good show, but it just wasn't good enough. What's up here smoking? Was that it? Oh, no. Not hardly.
So it's that cargo box is smoking. Very weird. Well, anyway. Okay, so this is going to be my work platform, and in the center here, I'm going to have, in fact, let me do this right now, um, this could disappear, right? Yep. Okay, so... Damn, I keep forgetting where the door is. Here's the door. Alright, come in here. That's the little baby I'm looking for. This ship doesn't need it. Right about here. Yeah, that looks good. No. Um, ah, here we are. There we go. Yeah. was that all right so I might need to pull it in a little bit there's a little bit of an overlap is what I'm what I'm seeing here I am so happy about that I just love that that was so cool I just put a ramp up there, so you walk up the ramp, and bam! Okay, so I'm going to complete this platform, including uh, tubing, and I will be back in a bit. See you then.